Man, I just hit 5K subs and I've been getting some awesome well wishes. I really wanted to thank you guys. And I mean, ah, uh, it's just so friggin' exciting. Come on. Yeah. Ah. Uh. Ah, uh, dude, I gotta call Wolf. He just hit 5K subscribers. I gotta congratulate him. Hello? Hey, dude, it's Russ Lyman. What's up? Dude, congratulations. 5K subscribers, man. What a feat. Dude, thanks, man. I'm telling you, it was not easy. It's It's been a couple years, honestly. Hey, you pushed through, you put out awesome content, and you got there, man. Here's to many more for sure. But listen, dude, I sent you a package in the mail. Should have gotten there by now. So have a look around. Let me know if you find it. I think you're going to be stoked, dude. Dude, from you? Oh, man, man, you didn't have to. Hey, let me, let me, go, let me go scope out the yard real quick. Hold on. Cool. All right, man. I'll talk to you later. So awesome. Congratulations to that dude. <laughs> Whoa. Hello? <laughs> hey Wolf, what's up? Awesome, glad you found him, man. Super excited that you're stoked on him. Mega Man Legends, glad I nailed the theme and you're enjoying it. Mm -hmm. No. Nah, no, dude, that's awesome. No, so excited for you, man. Yeah, we, we probably don't have to keep doing the, the phone bit. It's it's not connected to, to anything. <laughs> hey guys, what's going on? I'm Russ Lyman, so I did the custom Mega Man Legends PlayStation for Wolf. I want to tell you guys about it and a little bit of what I do. Tell them. Tell them who you are. So Wolf came to me. He had seen some consoles that I have done in the past. I did a cool Super Mario Brothers 3 console. I have done Resident Evil PlayStation. That came out awesome. There's a whole bunch on my channel, so I kind of focus on video game DIY. So when he wanted something custom for his game room, reached out to me. So I pick and choose from the game itself some elements that I thought would look cool as a console. The PlayStation itself is nice and flat, so it's a good canvas to uh, convey a cool theme to. And uh, yeah, I think I nailed it pretty good. I do have a full video of how I put together the PlayStation over on my YouTube channel, Russ Lyman. So if you want to check that out, you can do that as well. But Russ, you savant, what got you in to video game DIY? So I do drive a custom Super Mario Kart car. I've always enjoyed modding the car once I seen like Fast and Furious and you can make your car yourself and, and put cool stuff on it. I was like, let me combine video games and a car, Mario Kart in real life. And not only that, I also made a Yoshi scooter. So I'm always diving into different DIY projects, usually with a video game theme to it. When I have time to dive into these, uh, you know, I'm super excited to, to do a theme that I haven't done before. So it, it poses a new challenge and it gets my creative gears turning. And 5,000K subscribers. Dude, congrats. That's totally awesome. Uh, YouTube certainly a hard game battling the algorithm, getting people to watch the videos. Now, I've been on YouTube for like 12, 13 years, I believe. I think we started back in 2009. Um, I've, I've gained a bunch of subscribers, put a bunch, almost 400 videos out. A lot of DIY, some video game hunting, and I know the struggle. It's tough to keep going when sometimes the videos don't perform as well, and you just got to keep pushing, keep making that content, and hopefully people find it they react to it, maybe they'll leave some comments. You get that nice conversation going on for sure. I know you got more than just the YouTube channel going on. What else are you cooking up over there? So Wolf was actually on the podcast that I run many moons ago. We're on now on like episode 65. I think Wolf came on at like episode six or something like that. But I do run a podcast weekly. It's called The Weekly Warp Pipe with my buddy Jay, the NES addict. And it's all about retro video game stuff, nostalgia, like retro toys, fashion, food. Uh, you know, it's about going into the warp pipe 
going back and reliving a little nostalgia. So if you guys want to check out the podcast, it's it's anywhere podcasts are, Spotify, iTunes, Google, or you can watch it on YouTube, The Weekly Warp Pipe. Dude, I can't thank you enough, man. And, you know, beyond hitting this 5K and really just making this channel to have fun, I have made some of the best friends I think I've ever made in my life. Just in this community, with this YouTube channel, meeting up at conventions and stuff. Man, I just, I just can't. Dude, super excited. Glad you like the Mega Man Legends PlayStation. Hopefully, they'll make a Mega Man Legends collection game. I know they've done some of the other series. So, hey, fingers crossed. Let's go. Capcom, a lot of collections coming out. Let's see Mega Man Legends. Don't. Don't give me that hope. All right. I got to get back to this phone call right here. But as always, guys, I'm Russ Lyman. And keep your world fun bit by bit. I'll see you next video. Dude, thanks. Oh, thanks again, man. I can't even. I can't even with this. It is so cool. You know what? And as a little special bonus on this video, um, I actually, I recorded myself opening it like straight up live. So I'm going to put that right right now. So this is a little bit of a bonus video. Uh, this is the actual unboxing of what this is. Uh, obviously, if you're watching this far, you've already seen the episode. Um, but I just wanted to get a live reaction for this for real. Um, so this is from my buddy Russ, a good friend of mine. He's really, really good at like making custom consoles and custom action figures and controllers and cool stuff. Um, so this is kind of his stuff. He has the, uh, oh, it's a magnet. The Weekly Warp Pipe. It's a little, it's a little deal he does, a little podcast kind of deal he does. Keep the world fun bit by bit. Weekly Warp Pipe sticker. A thank you card with a Russ sticker in it. Uh, but I'm so jazzed to see this. Oh my God, I'm so jazzed to see this. So if you've already watched the episode, then, I mean, obviously I'm putting this at the end of the episode. So you've already seen it. You've seen it before me at this point. So for context, I asked him a long time ago, uh, and he's been just been quite busy, and we haven't really got together on ideas about, man, you know, my favorite game is Mega Man Legends, and I would love a cool, like, custom Mega Man Legends PlayStation. And that's what he made. So, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Is it in the frame good? Oh my god. This is so sick. Ah! Oh man. So, whoa. This is badass. Okay. So, the idea, the concept, which obviously freaking nailed it, is the Gessel Shaft from Mega Man Legends. Basically, like, it's the ship. Um, so the buttons kind of are, they, um, they're the, uh, what do you call it? Like, it's, it's, it's like the rivets on the ship. So this would be like the front of the ship and these would be like the rivets. So he made that for the open. Ah, uh, he even signed the inside. Can you see that? He even signed the inside. How fucking cool is that? Ugh. So he weathered it a bit. Man, it just looks so effing good. Oh man, so the sides has a really, it feels, it feels like super high quality. Like it's like, like, I don't know what kind of paint or whatever he used, but it feels like really, really high quality. Um, let's see the back. The back is like the ship. Ah, made by Russ Lyman. This is so cool, dude. Thank you so much. Oh my God. I don't know, we haven't got to get together on the script for the show yet. I'm re literally recording this like way before we even plotted what we're gonna do. So I hope whatever we did turned out cool because this turned out freaking amazing. Dude, Russ, thanks again, man. Everybody who watched this far and got to see this part, um, go and like subscribe to him, check out his stuff. Obviously his stuff is freaking amazing. This is freaking amazing. Oh, I'm so jazzed. Ah, oh, thanks again. Dudes, and that is what is up, man. 5K subscribers, like I said, I could not have got here if it wasn't for my friends, friends like Russ Lyman. If it wasn't for the viewers, you guys, I mean, for just watching and subscribing, I thank you so much. 
Um, man, this is this is dope. This is really cool. It's really humbling. It's just it's awesome. I can't believe when I started this that my channel would even become close, like this close, like not even a tenth of what this is. Hey, Russ, thanks again, man. Everyone, I have a link to his um, his channel down below. Check out his stuff. He's obviously the man. Um, but you know, I just, I can't say thank you enough. This is phenomenal. Hey, that's gonna do it for us today, guys. Once again, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for 5K subscribing. But as always, my friends, take it easy.